Hi everybody, it's Margo. I'm back with another Dollar Tree haul and yes, I'm wearing the same sweater. I had to film all this in one day. Had a very busy weekend. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And if you haven't already, please hit the notification bell. Bell, excuse me. Notification button. That way you are notified every time a video is posted. I try to separate things into categories. Let's start with the old boring stuff first. I needed plates and I really don't care for foam plates too much, but I was at the Dollar Tree. Didn't want to go anywhere else, so we'll deal with it for this uh, this week. Then I picked up some tortilla chips. I am making a buffalo cheese dip. My husband loves the, that brand. My husband also likes these. I picked these up for him. The fries, the smart fries. This one is the classic sea salt. And then this one is the aged white cheddar. My husband prefers chips over sweets, and I'm opposite. <laughs> I did get some English muffins. We do like these English muffins. For a dollar, you can't beat it. And I did buy like four of them to throw in the freezer. Like I said, I was stocking up on the dollar items. Well, while they're still a dollar, I should say. Our prices are going to supposedly going up. By the time you see this video, they had already gone up. I picked up these Smarties candies for the my niece's daughters. And I believe I'm done getting items for their Valentine basket. I saw these hauled by many people and they look really good. I do want to try them. The Pioneer Country Gravy Mix. I picked up two of each kind. These do sell at Walmart for like 97 cents, but that's okay. So, and the other flavor I picked up was the sausage flavor. And I, I picked up two of these. If any of you have tried these, let me know in the comment below if this is something you like. And if it is, which flavor did you like better? I picked up a pack of Almond Joys for Hubby. Then I found these chocolate fusion gourmet milk chocolate covered biscuits. I found them in the milk chocolate and the dark chocolate. And I have a funny story about these cookies. Every time I find a new cookie, I'll bring it to work. And I, I so all of us try them. So I brought these in and the peanut butter ones that I hauled in my last video. And the packs were sitting on the counter. So at break, I said, oh, let's try these cookies. Actually, we were probably 10 minutes into our break. And I went to open this pack up. And when I opened it up on this end, the pack had already been opened and one cookie was missing and I was like that's weird like why would someone just take a cookie so I didn't want to chance it I said I am not eating a cookie out of this pack so I threw it out then one of my co-workers I was telling her the story she said Margo I'm the one that opened the package and I'm the one that ate one <laughs> so <laughs> needless to say I threw out a pack of cookies that I didn't have to throw out. So she had opened it on one end and put it back in the package and I didn't see that. And I opened it on the other end. But anyways, that was the funniest thing. So she really loves dark chocolate. So I'm gonna give her this box <laughs> so she can have it for herself. And then the rest of us will try this one. She said the cookie was good. I said, oh, well, that's nice. <laughs> and I did pick up, um, six bags of these so these are for my grand dog her name is Zena she's a beautiful beautiful husky I'll put a video or picture up of her she 
she absolutely loves these and she knows that grandma always has cookies for her so i did pick these up okay now this shampoo is my absolute favorite shampoo i've ever found at dollar tree and i believe it's the generic brand for the shea moisturizer or shea moisture um i bought the shampoo and the leave-in conditioner again like i said stocking up on the dollar items okay i did find these which i thought was a really good price this is a good brand ace you get a hundred poker chips for a dollar even for a dollar 25 that's a good price and i had been looking for these these magnets um magnet clips so you can put papers on the refrigerator these believe it or not are really heavy duty I put them on the fridge and they hold quite a bit of weight. Okay, a few new items I found. This is so cool. Zen Garden. It's a mini one to put on your desk. And I'll open it up. I'll let you know what it comes with. So you get a little bag of sand. You get a bag of rocks. A little rake cuteness a little tray to put everything in and the instructions very cute very cute and I picked up the tumble blocks I like to use these in craft they're tumbling tower game I like to use these in crafts so there's a 48 pack and there's a 72 pack so when I see the 72 packs, I usually pick up a couple of them. Then I found these party favors. I'm actually going to use these to put in the eggs for the East Red egg hunt that I, um, I host every year. But I bought several packs of these. Found some more brain teasers. These ones are all wood. Real wood 3D puzzle. I'll give these a try. I like this kind of stuff. There's three different kinds. Here's the second one. And these are distributed by Green Bar Briar. Excuse me. So everybody should be getting these. And here is the third one. I found some little Easter cutouts, these wooden ornaments. These are adorable. Um, so there's 14, I believe there's 14 in, and there's four, four different kinds, 14 per pack. Here's the Easter bunnies, the eggs, the carrots. And these are so cute, the little chicks. So yeah, I believe this is the only four that they had. If there are more, please let me know in the comments below. Then I found this, this was pretty interesting, Movie Countdown Collection. Um, it's for the Spider-Man movie. And it kind of looks like an advent calendar. There's 20 doors to open and let's see what comes in it 20 days of spidey surprises hmm i believe it's all little figures hold on let's find out i'm sure everybody's as curious as i am maybe All right, let's see what we have in here. Okay, so you can make a little display, and here are the little figures that go with it. So there's 20 pieces total. Very cute. Very cute for big Spider-Man fans. And in the garden section, 
I did find, I was looking for these. Someone had hauled these. I can't remember who it was. But these have the little wheels on them to make it easier to transport uh, bigger flower pots. This is pretty, pretty big. Planter trolley includes four wheels. So I did get two of these. I can't wait to start planting. I really can't. I had found, there's actually four to this collection, but I bought two of these, the ceramic frogs. These are adorable. The other two are actually, they're lying down. I saw this one on walmart.com, this exact one for $9.99. Too funny. Then I found this. Hoverway virtual reality glasses for a dollar. For a dollar. Pretty cool. I mean, they're really not that expensive in the store, but still, when you can get it for a dollar. And this works with smartphones up to 5.6 inch. And then in parentheses, it says iPhone 6 Plus. Immersion 3D experience, adjustable eyeglasses, built-in magnetic trigger. Pretty cool. I'll have to give that a whirl. I picked up two drinks. My husband had asked me to pick this up for him. This is just the Coke Zero. Then I did find this. My son and I both like pink lemonade, so we'll give this a try. I've never heard of this uh, Nature's Twist. It says caffeine free, so good. 110 calories per serving and it's a one liter. So if you've tried this, let me know what you think. Okay, I did find another cleaner. This is Tile Plus Foaming Bathroom Cleaner with Bleach. 33% more than 24 ounce. This is a 32 ounce. And it's from a Mary, a Mary Plus. Not sure, but we'll, we'll give it a try. I picked up two t-shirts for my husband. If you remember in the, well, I think it was the last haul, I hauled the um, fluorescent yellow or fluorescent green ones. And so I found the fluorescent orange. My husband loves the fluorescent color. They look good on him, too. This is by Gildan. So I did pick up two. So this is also a staple in our home. The oatmeal almond, oatmeal and almond yardly soap. So at Walmart, this is $3.74. Dollar Tree, obviously, it's a dollar. Will be a dollar twenty-five, but I did stock up on these also. Then we needed some dental picks, so I bought two different kinds. We normally use these. I really, really, really like these, but I wanted to try something new. And so I got these ones, and I did try them. I bought two packs of these and two of these, and hands down, these are better. In my opinion. It's in my opinion. Okay, a couple more items here. My husband uses these, the sandwich bags, some fold tops. He doesn't like the Ziploc sandwich bags. So I did stock up on, a, you know, a few of these too. Then I did pick up the hand and nail um, hand mask. Really like these. This one is distributed by Greenbrier. I really like these. And it says 15 to 20 minutes. These are by Spa April, but it is Greenbrier that distributes it. Picked up two of these hooks, the clear ones. These hold five pounds. These work great. They're just like the command hooks, but much cheaper. And last but not least, I picked up this planter. I actually want to make a centerpiece bouquet out of this. That's it for this haul. And for this haul, this one was $47 without tax. 
and that was at Dollar Tree, of course. And had I gone to Walmart or Amazon, the approximate price would be $157.70. And that is a difference of $110.70. And again, that's why I love Dollar Tree. Until next time, everybody. Bye. Bye.